Hello logical people, this is Venkatesh. Here is an interesting math puzzle for puzzle lovers. The question is, there are 49 dogs signed up to compete in the dog show. There are 36 more small dogs than large dogs signed up to compete. How many small dogs are signed up to compete? To break it down, uh, if there are 49 dogs total and there are 36 more small dogs than large dogs, you would subtract 36 from 49. By that measure, there are 13 large dogs and 36 small dogs. So that means the answer is 36 small dogs, right? Is that a trick question? Apparently not. Feel free to pause the video and give a try before checking the solution. I will be back in 10 seconds with the answer. The real answer is 42.5. Yes, 42 and a off dog. Yet somehow, even with the correct answer, we are still scratching our heads. A off dog? Yes. Here is why. 49 minus 36 is 13. 13 divided by 2 is 6 and off. So 36 plus 6 and off is equal to 42.5. Another simple way to solve this problem is through algebra. Let x equal the number of large dogs hence x plus 36 is the number of small dogs so x which is the total number of large dogs plus the number of small dogs equals 49 that's the same as saying 2x plus 36 which is equal to 49 2x is because as per the question there are 36 more small dogs than large dogs the base for both large and small dogs is x after substituting the values, x equals 13 over 2, which is equal to 6.5. So there are 6.5 large dogs and 42.5 small dogs. So there are multiple interpretations to this problem. I have picked one such interesting interpretation from Cora. Accordingly, many people have, of course, noted that a direct reading of this problem leads to the conclusion that there are 42 and off small dogs and thus six and of large dogs which is seemingly invalid however there are ways to resolve this apparent inconsistency within the limitations of the problem you may not be able to get an exact answer but you will be able to establish constraints on the range of possible answers which is better than simply saying there is no feasible way to satisfy the requirements of this problem both of these rely on rejecting the unstated assumption that small dogs and large dogs form a complete partition of the set of all dogs registered. One way is to think is that a possibility that at least one dog is registered in both the small and large categories. Thus, the sum of small dogs and large dogs is greater than 49 because the categories overlap. There are multiple possible solutions here are some possible ways. 42 small only dogs, 1 small and large dog and 6 large only dogs satisfies the problem. There are 49 dogs, 43 of which are small and 7 of which are large satisfying the constraints. Similarly, you can have 41 small only, 3 small and large and 5 large only. And so on up to 37 small only, 11 small and large and 1 large only. Another way to think about this is the possibility that there is a third category of dogs which we will call dogs of an unusual size which are neither large nor small. In this case there are seven possible solutions the first of which is 36 small, 0 large and 13 dogs of an unusual size and the last of which is 42 small, 6 large and 1 dog of an unusual size. Here the point is of course is that the problem is solvable if you reject the unstated assumption that every dog is exactly one of large and small. So it has officially been confirmed a off dog did in fact compete in this dog show. Did you get the answer right in your first try? Let us everyone know your answer in the comment section. These are the few interpretations to this puzzle. If you have a different interpretation do share in the comment section. That is all for this video. Uh, let me know for any questions. I will try to address as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. Let's meet in the next video with one more interesting puzzle. Thank you.